What is going on guys, Adam here at Hound of Hell Gaming. So we've just uh, unleashed the iron grip that the Mongols had on Asimo Bay. Uh, we've released all the captives there. We've taken back control completely. Uh, it's now time for me to go and speak to Yuna and Taka um, and find out what this uh, tool or weapon is that Taka's going to make for me to help save Lord Chimera. Um, so let's go do that. We'll take out any bad guys along the way. There's always plenty of them. There you go, straight away. No messing around there. Um, so yeah, let's go do that and see what happens from there. Uh, the story, I think, is really about to pick up. I think we will be rescuing Lord Shimmera pretty soon. Um, oh, nice. Yeah, I think we'll be rescuing Lord Shimmera soon. Uh, and then the story goes crazy from there. I messed up the second one. Jeez, I hate those big brutes. I can't wait till we get the stance uh, that you unlock that helps you take on those brutes. Absolute nightmare. You don't throw all your kunais at them, you're a bit screwed. Komatsu, Yuna and Taka should be there. Fighting ahead. You might be wondering, uh, yeah. You might be wondering what I'm trying to do. Uh, I can hear in the headphones that that predator, or whatever it was, a wild boar, bear, whatever, I could hear it following us, even though it wasn't showing on the screen. I can still hear it now. Okay, we might have lost it. Uh, I'll try and keep an eye out for that. Um, I couldn't hear it with a bow from there and I wasn't willing to waste all my arrows trying. Um, but yeah, I need to watch my back with that one. I can hear this battle, but I don't have a clue where it is. This is the problem with no mini map. No, nothing to guide you other than the wind. Like it's a good idea, you know, it's something different. That's fine, but a mini map as well. Like, even if it's just one for close proximity. <laughs> Hmm? 
Yuna, is that you? Jin! You made it. What happened here? Where's Taka? Hiding with what's left of Komatsu. Mongols came a few days ago. They took prisoners. Killed anyone who put up a fight. Now they're coming back to finish the job. These were just scouts. The main force won't be far behind. Then we have to go. Now. We can hold this town. What? We need Komatsu's forge. And its people. If you need to, you can leave. No. I'm tired of running. Take me to the others. survivors are left a few families mostly farmers and blacksmiths not worth much in a fight you killed all these men by yourself good work I've had some practice can you get more arrows used ones stuck in buildings and bodies they'll have to do I was out here leading villagers to safety one of them got trapped over here by the Mongols she's alive I is it safe? The Mongols are gone, for now. We're going to the forge. You'll be safer with us. Is the forge working? Yes, but we can't light it. The smoke will give us away. Show the Mongols where to find us. We can use it to lure them in. Force a fight at a location we control. They won't be expecting you here. Lord Zakai! Yuna! Taka! I prayed the gods would protect you. I appreciate it, but I came for your help. Yuna said you needed something. A new tool. To save Lord Shimura. He's held prisoner in Castle Canada, and I need to break him out. Quietly. With no one seeing. This town has a forge. And you're a blacksmith. The best. I might be able to make something. But there is no time. The Mongols! I won't let them take Kumatsu. We're staying. I need my assistant, Yukio. But we got separated. Where is he? I think he was looking for his wife. In town. I'll find Yukio. You know, be ready to fight. She always is.
Yukio? Yes? Taka needs help with the forge. Follow me. Wait! My wife and her sister are by the river. Lead me to them. Quickly. This way. Stay close and follow my orders. Who is that man? You'll ask him. Is it just me being paranoid or anyone else who's played this game? Do you always worry that the prisoners that you're releasing are actually bad guys and it's all a setup? It just feels like you can't trust anybody on this game. And like I, I, the, the guy who sells the sake as well, I think it was Kenja his name, don't trust him as far as I can throw him. Uh, I'm just dead paranoid on it and I think that they're going to try and stab us in the back at some point. So much blood. Don't look at it. Look at me. Yes, my lord. The Mongols found them. Stay here. Sent me. He's alive. Follow me. Taka needs your husband. Mutsu, my love. Yukio, I thought I lost you. Are you hurt? That man fought like an animal or a demon. Only when I'm facing Mongols. Here, We're you going to the forge. Wait. Stay close. <laughs> Who nicken heads us, Samurai or Hoss Nash Pussot? Thirteen by you. What's 
I absolutely hate that sign above the head telling you that they're going to go and try and assassinate the hostages. It just instills fear in you and I don't know why because you, you can wait for ages and they still don't actually attack them. But it just does something to you, you just panic. You just panic, you're rushing, you need to go and deal with it straight away just in case. Like it's, it's a cool thing that they've added there. I don't remember seeing that in another game to be perfectly honest. You know, it might have been in another game but I personally don't remember seeing it. Thank you, my lord. The Mongols are here. Where's Yuna? She went to get a family from the house across the river. Hasn't come back. Damn. Don't light the fortune until we come back. Ready to light the forge. Taka said you're looking for a family. I was too late. The Mongols captured them just across the river. Those people took my brother in when he was an apprentice. Then we won't leave him behind. Let's go. Samurai. Where is Samurai, Del? Ruth. Or I hurt your friends. We don't know any Samurai. Best of your people. It's not safe. The Mongols stripped the beach, took every katana they could find. Fear you, Tolaja! This fight's not over. Can you make it to the forge? Yes. I think so. Everyone stay close to me. Where did he come from? It's a long story. The way he killed them. He's not human. Maybe all right.
Yuna! Thank the gods. Light the forge, Tucker. What about the Mongols? They won't risk destroying this place. That gives us a chance to kill them all. If they don't kill us first. Either way, this is where we make our stand. I love a good old final stand, I really do. Except for X-Men. X-Men final, uh, final stand or last stand, whatever it was called. That should be a race from my memory. Hopefully they'll bring out something that kind of raise your memory. There's a few things that we need to get out of our minds. A few things we've had to endure over the years. Not necessarily all like terrible things either. Yeah, the ending of Game of Thrones, that can go. We have to stop them. Help me kill I absolutely hate these dog things. Uh, I, I don't know if it's a dog. I don't know. If, I, I, I literally have no idea what it is. And if it's not a dog, then I'm even more confused. Um, I would imagine it's going to be some sort of Asian dog. A lot of them look like that. Loads of fur covering the face and stuff like that. Uh, especially back uh, in, the, in the days of the samurai, I can imagine dogs looked uh, pretty crazy, to be perfectly honest. Especially with the amount of fur they probably had. You know, you got uh, things like... Uh, is it a Tibetan Mastiff and stuff like that? Um, so there's plenty from Asia. Um, it's probably someone on Wikipedia that now, and it won't even be from Asia. Um, but there's plenty of dogs from Asia that look absolutely bonkers.
I've never seen a samurai fight like that. It was nothing. You are more than a samurai. He is a vengeful spirit. Back from the grave to slaughter the Mongols. Where do we hide now? You don't. Fire up a forge. And get back to making strong Komatsu weapons. That's how we fight back. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. Vengeful spirit? I think they liked it. I read that samurai follow a path of honor. It is none of the many differences between us. Hmm. Then why have my men found their brothers stabbed in the back? Lord Sakai would never resort to such tactics. War brings out who we truly are. It has made you a dog, unleashed by your cousin Kublai to rape and pillage at his command. Your nephew strays from the warrior's path. He will become what you hate. Unless you join my empire's fight for peace. You don't want allies. You want soldiers to overthrow the Shogun. Consider my offer. Help your nephew regain his honor before his cowardice goes too far. And before I bring you his head. I can't free my uncle until Taka finishes what he's working on. I should see if Yuna has any news. I should see if Yuna has any news. No point in messing about and traveling somewhere else, is there? Might as well do this mission while I'm here. Spreading more of your stories? Just telling them what they want to hear. Some of them are calling you the ghost. After you put the idea in their heads. These people stay because they believe in you. They should believe in the samurai. To them, you're both. When Lord Shimura is free, they won't need to put their faith in folk tales. Maybe. Taka's sweating over the job you gave him. He doesn't want to let you down. Let's see how it's coming along. You're looking for warriors to help save your uncle. Any luck? Some. Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masako Adachi are still alive. They're dealing with their own struggles, but when it's time, they've agreed to help. An archer. And a noble woman. You sure that's enough? That's why I hired the store hat Ronin. Turns out their new leader is an old friend of mine. Well, sounds like you have all the help you need. Will you join us? I don't know. Can someone help with this? I'll get it. 
Go see Taka. We'll catch up later. My lord, I just finished it. Thank you for your patience, my lord. An iron hook with a rope attached to the end. You can use it to climb walls. Swing over things. It'll hold my weight? I tested it myself. I call it a Kaginawa. It's perfect. A minutet. No. It's a gift. I have my sister, my home, my life. That's enough. Thank you, Taka. Jin! Where are you? Yuzo? Jin! Jin Sakai! Anyone steal a samurai? I know you're here! I've been looking all over for you. The Mongols have captured my best fighters. I was counting on their help to free Lord Shimura. Jin, if we don't do something, my men are dead, and your uncle stays locked in captivity. Where are they? Caged near Fort Yatade. All right, Iruzo. Let's see what we can do. You said they're in cages near Fort Yatate. Where exactly? The cages are actually inside the fort. <sighs> At the top of a cliff. How are we going to free your people from there? I still have a few men who weren't captured. They're waiting for us at a crossroads nearby. We'll need the extra swords. Lead the way. How were your men captured? Remember that map you gave me? Oh, the one showing Mongol supply lines. Did you find food? Yes. Hey, Jin! Yes. Very well guarded food. Too many guards for your best men? The ugly bastards were all over us. I barely got away myself. And you're sure the men are alive? I heard them singing last night. Hmm. I'm surprised the Mongols allowed that. So am I. Are you good singers? Might be more pleasant than mercenary work. <laughs> I didn't choose this life. It was my only option after our duel. Oh, at Lord Nagal's tournament. We never talked about it. Before we spawn, I invited commanders from every clan to watch. You came at me like I was your mortal enemy. Almost broke my arm. I'm sorry. It was my first tournament. I got swept up in the excitement. Of course you did. Every samurai on the island wanted to meet the Chito's nephew. I never thought of it like that. You were born, Lord Sakai. That tournament was my one chance to gain attention. To enter the service of a lord, become a samurai. You should have come to me. I would have hired you. Because no one else would? No. I needed to prove myself. I wish you told me this earlier. Maybe I should have. Someone in Kumatsu called you the ghost. Was Lord Sakai not good enough? What's wrong? Afraid I'll get more famous than you? Where's Hiro and Shinzo? They left. And they're not coming back. Cowards! <sighs> Running off. After all I did to keep them alive. We still have enough to save your men. I've worked with less. I've lost men to Mongols. Sickness. Hunger. But never this. They're weak. It's not your fault. Anyone else want to leave? That 
That's it. Nice and easy. It'll be dark soon. Ready to ride the boat out today? We'll figure out how to free your men on the way. Straw hats! Ride! So I'll try my best not to talk when there's some story dialogue going on. I don't want people to miss out on that. I don't like it in games when people are talking through cutscenes uh, on the YouTube videos and stuff like that. Each to their own. Some people might not care, but I do. Fort Yatate. That's where the bastards are holding my men. What's your rescue plan? My plan? You're the one who got us onto that Mongol ship. Hmm. There's only one road into the fort, and it'll be heavily guarded. I need to get inside without being seen. The Mongols won't be watching the cliffs at the back of the fort. I'll climb up, go over the wall. How? Are you half monkey? <laughs> I have something to help me. I'll free your men. Once they're with me, I'll set off one of the alarms. That's your signal to ride in. And crush the Mongols between us. See? I knew you'd have a plan. I'll find a way up the cliff on this side. Stay hidden until you see my signal. Good luck. Don't fall. Here. Can't jump that gap. Taka says his hook will support my weight. this hook. So I'd actually completely forgot about this grappling hook and all this uh, parkour and swinging stuff that we can now be doing. Uh, it's a, a nice dynamic and the fact that it wasn't in the game for such a long period at the beginning it kind of has now given the game a really really fresh twist to it um, and I really like what they've done there so you can't really get too bored of a game if they completely switch things up a quarter of the way through, a third of the way through, however far through we are uh, so it's a fantastic introduction at this point in the game um, and if they actually planned it that way, that's amazing. <sighs> Need to find Ryuzo's men. They really are singing. Sounds like they're caged all over the fort.
Cinta. So I've been having a think about this game um, and what I think they could have done better, what I think they could have changed. You've heard me waffle on about how I don't like the gnome minimap, how I don't like the uh, the guided wind instead of it being a waypoint on the minimap or something like that. Um, those are two things that I would really have liked to have seen different. The other major thing that I think would have would have suited the game so much better is making making basically Jin Sakai die on that beach at Komada and the ghost be born and him wear a mask at all times and no one ever know that that's Jin Sakai or at least not know until the end of the game uh, you know even um, if we rescue his uncle his uncle doesn't find out who the ghost is and I think that would have made it so much better from a story standpoint. Uh, I think it would have given it a different dynamic. Uh, as the player of Jin here, it's not all that believable, all the things that you keep hearing from people that you speak to about how uh, they've never seen anybody fight that way, how it's like he's possessed by a demon and things like that. Like Those things don't feel true to you as you're the player of the game. But if... If you were a, a soulless, non-identity person, maybe maybe it would feel that way. Maybe you would feel more like the ghost that they want you to be. And that would be the big change that I would have made to the story, especially make Jin Sakai die on that beach and make the ghost born. That, for me, would have completely made this game and the story way above what it is. And I think the story is fantastic. I think this is a great game. I think this is a game that has really pushed boundaries. I think this is a game that came out late into the PS4 cycle that is believable to be a PS5 game. So that's what I would have done. Uh, all the characters, I feel, are quite compelling. I think they've done a good job with that. Um... There's lots of things to come. Uh, I'm not going to give any spoilers. Um, I have played this game before, but a lot of people watching might not have done. So I'm not going to give any spoilers about the twists and the turns that the story's going to take. But it does have twists and turns, and that's another fantastic element to the game. Um, so that's what I'm thinking. So let me know in the comments if you agree. Let me know if there's anything you think could have been done differently. Uh, let me know if there's anything you want adding into Ghost of Tsushima 2. Um, and yeah, I would love to get people's opinions and thoughts on it. I, I was really, really having a good deep think about it the other day, and that's what I came up with. Um, th that's what I would have liked to have seen. Oh, my God. 
What? How? Get ready to fight. Lead the way. Lord Sapphire. Glad you're all right. I'm better now. Set up an alarm and get Vuzo in here. All right, Yuzo. We're ready for you. Time to open the gate. Hey! 
Forget us. Give him anything he asks. We place bets. How long did it take you to free us? <laughs> I lost. <laughs> Hope you brought some sake. <laughs> You're not going to believe this. It doesn't make any sense. What doesn't? My men said the Mongols didn't hurt them. They fed them. Good food, too. No wonder they were singing last night. Just be grateful they're safe. Why in all the hells would the Mongols feed them? Maybe they expected something in return. Thank you, Jin. My men. They're everything. All right, men. On your horses. I need to meet Yuna in Komatsu. So I will call it quits at this point for this episode. I really appreciate anybody stopping by and watching this video. Thank you very much for your time. Time is very important, very valuable. Uh, and I'll catch you on the next one. Take care, guys, and see you later.